we're, Lyric Culture is bringing to life the life of the famous, iconic Blondie celebration. We have two very special guests joining us today, Debbie Harry and Christine, the dynamic duo who started together back in 1974 with over 40 million albums sold worldwide. <laughs> and truly, you changed the way that women look at fashion, feel fashion, look at themselves, even the way that we feel about music. So welcome both of you today. Thank you. It's all Thank her you. fault. Is it all her fault, Chris? Yeah. Is that what, <laughs> for the past, what, 43 years, it's been your fault, right? <laughs> well, he fired me the other, the other day. But... What? <laughs> I can't, I don't remember why, but. Yeah, I can't remember. I think he did. He, he fired you. Well, we're glad that you're here and working together with Lyric Culture to put together, really, a once-in-a-lifetime capsule event where you get to take those iconic styles and rock them your own way. In fact, Juliana Rancic's going to be joining us as well. We have Lyric Culture here. Hannah's going to be sharing with us, Hannah Rochelle, on how you can rock out these fashions. But we are thrilled to have both of you here. It truly is an honor. Thanks. And thank you for sharing with us. Well, that's where I, I feel too. I feel that you guys have gone way, way above, you know, above and beyond. To, the call uh, of duty. Yeah, to, to, you know, put this all together and, and uh, it's great to be here. Well, thank you again. We're thrilled you're here. And there's a lot to talk about tonight aside from fashions, but you're also into saving bees. And I think, you know, moving into your new album that's coming out, Pollinator, which is available right now. You can order that and it's coming out Cinco de Mayo day. So 5-5, five, five, we'll make sure you have yours by then. The item number for that's at the bottom of your screen and you also are going to receive five additional bonus as soundtracks, but since your new album is entitled Pollinator, you're doing something to save the bees because it's an epidemic now worldwide. Well, we're trying to, you know, bring more consciousness to it and to make people um, understand to go green, you know, mm -hmm. it's very, very important. But the, and we don't think people really appreciate the problem that is involved with what's called colony collapse. 90% um, of wild plants and 30% of cultivated crops are all bee pollinating related, you know, so if all that stuff goes, it's a big problem. And that's why you're here today, because you're actually going to be donating today yes. to help save the bees. And you can do the same, too, by going to hsn.com. And there you can check out HSN Care, so you can see how you can make a difference as well. But I hope you're ready, because we've got a two-hour limited edition capsule event with Lyric Culture and Blondie. Okay, I see Juliana standing by. I see so many of you already excited that we do have the Blonde Collection here with us at HSN. We have Hannah Rochelle, who is our special guest, who tonight ties in the music, the fashion, and you bring it all to life with us with this limited capsule event, and we like to call it Lyric Culture. So welcome. Thank you so much for having me. I mean, I am so excited to be here to talk about Blondie and the fashion and the lyrics and these amazing songs that Debbie Harry and Chris Stein have written. And I think everybody has like their theme song from Blondie, right? And we're gonna share with you how you can take your theme song and bring it to life. We have her iconic leather jacket coming up with Juliana, jeans, and so much more. But we're gonna kick it up with this amazing, what we call, and again, it's just a regular scarf here, but notice what Blondie did. It's the woven scarf. It's $29.90 and you have it in pink or black. It's on two credit card payments. And of course, here at HSN, if you're a new shopper, we take every major credit card and we kind of, Space out those payments so you can get it home today for under $15. What I love about this scarf is that so the lyrics cute. to one way or another are on here. And Debbie Harry actually hand wrote this. So this is her handwriting. And you can wear this around your neck. You can wear this. I was actually <laughs> thinking about wearing this around my waist like this. It is so fun. And uh, I think the song was written about a possessive boyfriend, I think. Yes? Who hasn't had one of those? <laughs> Who hasn't okay, had a possessive boyfriend? <laughs> And I love that line, I'm gonna get you, get you, get you, get you. Isn't that like hey. such, I mean, who doesn't know that, right? We're still doing that, right? And so throughout the next two hours, we're gonna get to hear and to see so many different designs with so many different song lyrics by uh, Debbie Harry and Chris Stein. I mean, that songwriting duo is like Lennon McCartney, Mick Jagger and Keith Richards, one of the most iconic. And between the years of 1977 and 1982, they cranked out so many hits, one hit after another, like you mentioned, 40 
40 million albums sold. Wow. So this is one of my favorite pieces in the collection, and it's an accessory. It really is unisex. I think Absolutely. guys and girls can wear this. And there's only 540 remaining, that's it. Everything you're seeing tonight from Lyric Culture is incredibly limited. Everybody's been excited to have the Blondie collection come to life. So a lot of you have gone to hsn.com to place your order. I believe the shirt that I'm wearing is almost sold out. Your shirt's almost sold out. Because again, what we love that Debbie did is she changed the way that we look at fashion forever. Forever. So again, I hate to call these trend pieces no. or... This is no. part of our lifestyle. And I think anybody, yeah. whether it's in the 70s, 80s, 90s, it's still relevant fashion today. It absolutely is. And Debbie Harry really paved the way for artists like Madonna and Gwen Stefani and Sia and Pink um, and their whole look. And Lady Gaga, I mean, she was the original that came up with all of these really cool pieces. All right, well, we're going to continue on with the collection. We'd love the chance to say hello to you. Please be part of our show. The number to dial is 1-866-376-8255. We're moving on to the hoodie jumpsuit. This has zip detailing on it. It's less than $100. Here's heads up. There's 700 left. This is it. This is a capsule event that we put together with Lyric Culture, so we're gonna walk through whether you want this to be casual, edgy, or dressy and chic. It's all on the accessories and how you pull it off. Mm -hmm. So starting off with the front here, this is the Lyric, and that's the black, white, and red. And Born. these are the lyrics to Heart of Glass. Heart of Glass. Another song that everybody knows. Right behind that, we have it for what we're calling our photo print. And this is a photograph by Chris Stein. Look at and he that. can talk about that photo. And then right behind that, we've got it for you in the classic black. I love that everything's made in the USA. It's yeah. easy care, easy wear. You throw it in the washing yeah. machine. And a jumpsuit was the quintessential piece that you had to wear at Studio 54. And nobody did a jumpsuit better than Debbie Harry. There are so many different photos of her wearing the jumpsuit. I mean, she invented that jumpsuit. Oh, yeah. Now everybody wears them, but that was, she was the original with the hood and all of that. Again, these are hand handwritten lyrics. Heart of Glass. I think the song when it was first written in 74 was called the Disco Song. It had that BG Stand Alive type vibe. And then later it was called, turned into talk, I think called Heart of Glass. You guys want to speak to that a little bit? Really? Okay. <laughs> no, but this is, I mean, Anything else you want to tell us about this song, it definitely is one that resonates oh, with please. so many different people when they... I don't know about you, but I sound fantastic singing it in the shower. Let's hear. In the shower. <laughs> oh, not here. In the shower. That's the only way I can get that level, Miss Debbie. <laughs> Bring in the shower, please. Bring in the shower. <laughs> Just, I, you know what? Would you like I, a little bit? I can't even begin to get that note. But you, <laughs> Juliana, have you ever tried in the shower singing this song? Of course. Are you kidding? I know. I'll sing it right now. No, I'm kidding. I can't. Not in your <laughs> presence. I can't even. I can't even. I, I won't even embarrass myself uh, but, but you do, I mean I think when you think of that song there's not a person in the world who doesn't know that song yeah, exactly. I mean that just set yeah. the tone for everything yeah. and again when you look at the jumpsuits yeah. it brings that whole story to right. life for and us if you're that. nostalgic and you know you went to studio 54 don't you want one of these and this where else are you gonna get one of these jumpsuits with actual photography by Chris Stein and if you look closely into the glasses you actually see your reflection right in the glasses <laughs> Very oh. cool. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Oh, I never noticed that. Again, this it, they're just such unique pieces. Yeah. And again, mm. we do have it in the classic black. I love that there's a hood to this. This is yeah. that edgy vibe that Debbie the, does yeah. so well. The model's really, really wearing it really well with the hood. I love the fabric. It's got it's an oversized hood. It really is a, a really unique piece and so easy to wear. I mean, this is one thing where you could just put on the mm -hmm. piece one item. You don't have to do anything else. I mean, you could throw over the sequin jacket, but it is really great um, as is. And uh, you know, a lot um, a lot of the fashion that uh, that Debbie really brought to life was inspired by Stephen Sprouse. Um, back right, in the day, right. and he lived yeah. with you in, in the apartment, right? right. Somewhere yeah. in the yeah. Bowery. Yeah. Several times. And yeah. uh, and one of my favorite pieces that he did for you was like a, a made out of a pillowcase, like a zebra pillowcase. I, everyone knows that photo. If, they, if you guys pull, pull it up, the producer can pull it up. It's okay. a really great photo. But yeah. I actually made that. You made that. I'm sorry. That's okay. Yeah. He, he sculpts style it. Yes. Yes. He was involved. Yes. Oh, wow. So yeah. I love you're learning the story behind <coughs> all of the unique garments that we're sharing with you. This is on its way selling out, but we're going to hand things over to Juliana because we've got some great kind of behind the scenes we want to share with everybody. Yeah, I'm I'm super excited, I have to say, because I was uh, so honored to be able to design some pieces in this collection. I've been a fan forever, and I know that people are super excited about your new album. 
coming out. You Thank said you. it was May 5th. Thank you. Uh, tell me, what can fans expect from this album? Well, I think it's <clears throat> it's an interesting collection, and, and the title Pollinator relates to the fact that, you know, when we sort of set out and, and you know, discovered the kind of music that we wanted to make, you know, we sort of influenced a, a lot of younger musicians along the way. Sure. And so in turn, with this album, we've taken music from a lot of, you know, people that we admire that are, you know, y younger than us. And it, it sort of describes, you know, what happens, you know, we all learn from the things that we go through and from That's other right. artists. So. Everybody's younger than us. <laughs> Stop it. Not everybody. Get out of here. You know what? Let's take a listen. I think we have some uh, a, a piece of the music, uh, one of the music videos. Take a look at this. I love it. It's fun. It's fast. You look amazing, by Thank the you. way. Wow. Gorgeous always. Uh, Amy, we're going to toss it back to you oh, because wow. this jacket, okay. <laughs> My name is all over that jacket. Everybody's I need been one of wanting those. this jacket. I just have to say, yeah. it's kind of like ready, set, go on this jacket because when you look at Debbie wearing this, you can layer this if you want to. We've yeah. got gold and black. <gasps> oh, and look what's the on the side. Inside. Look at the yeah. inside. Okay, so real quick, there's 800 of these in the gold, in the black, extra small through 3X. I love again. this. And this is I'm again. I'm sort of wondering if you could turn it inside out and wear it. I think you could actually. You could absolutely turn it inside out. You could just take off the tag easily yeah. and wear it inside out. That's a great suggestion, Debbie. I love that. We never even thought of that, but yes. It is, can absolutely be reversible. What's, again, this has the amazing Chris Stein photo. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> and you can actually see him in the glasses, so we love that. And this is definitely got that disco vibe to it, right? But I like that you can just wear this with a pair of jeans, and now mm -hmm. you can go out to dinner, but you can make it, it's like a casual thing, and again, if you reverse it, that's a great idea, too. Yeah. I love that. And, and it, it stretches. It's stretchy. Yeah. This is so comfortable. It actually feels like a sweatshirt when you put it on. Yeah. And you so, know what? We're going to share with you some great inspiration stills on how this came to life. But I have to ask, Debbie, you, did you love sequins? Was sequins like your big thing? Or, or would you rather wear silk? Or what was it that you really look forward to wearing on stage? Oh, on stage, uh, I don't know. I, I think, um, I, think I, I sort of really liked fabric that moved, you know, yeah. like, a, um, like the, the pants, the... the the jumpsuits, the, jump yeah. the jersey straps, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. the spandex. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think, uh, I think I probably wore everything you could possibly. Uh, <laughs> if I could lay my hands on it, I'd wear it, you know. Um, but Chris was uh, very, very good at advising me. You you know? think? Yeah, you were okay. very good. Would you say, okay, I'm going to wear this, and he would say, no, you're not wearing that. Would, did that ever happen? No. No, I always, I always asked his opinion because he, you know, he was, you know, he would give me good advice, you know. And I, for me, comfort is a, is a major factor. Mm -hmm. I have to feel gorgeous and comfortable. And that's not always easy, right? Uh, absolutely, it's yeah. not. But it's true, being on stage, especially what you do, yeah. to be creative, to be on stage, to give it your all, you can't be worried about something being tight or uncomfortable, right? No. So no. comfort is key. Yeah. I love that. And all yeah. these pieces are yeah. very comfortable. Yeah. And this, all of them. This feels like it's structured, but it's really not. There's a lot of movement so here and a lot of stretch. Yeah. So you get both that structured look with the feeling of movement that Debbie's talking about. Look at that. You can't go wrong with the black. Look at that. This is a statement piece. And again, when you're buying this, you're actually buying a piece of music history. These are all limited edition. We will never make them again. Look at so that. So it's now or never. <laughs> it's now or never. And they are going fast. Look at that. Aren't they? I'm telling you, they're so soft. I've never, usually when you think of sequins, they're scratchy and heavy and no. there's no stretch. Do you see the stretch that's inside of this? So there's a ton of stretch. And you know what? You can really make this edgy. Like I'd love to do the gold with jeans and a white t-shirt and wait till you see. 
the real blondie. Here it is. This jacket coming up. This is like mocked after the original. I know Juliana's <laughs> going to be talking about this. So this is going to be coming up. But this is another jacket option. But when you think about this kind of a jacket, you can make it so casual. Yeah. What I love about it too is the little secret. This is the conversation piece because someone compliments you on this jacket and then you go like this. And you're like, look what's inside. You've got a little secret there, right? And you can talk about the Chris Stein photo. And I know we're going to be exposed to a lot of Chris's photography in the book that we're going to be selling later on in the hour. All right, if you're ordering it, you've got it. Otherwise, we're losing sizes. There's 800 left. That's it forever. Never to be done again. This is a limited edition, a big capsule event that Lyric Culture put together for us. Everything is curated. We've got Juliana, who's going to be joining us with amazing jeans and some of the tops that you're seeing. We also have Daniel Nicole here with handbag. RJ Graziano with Blondie Pins. So we're bringing to you life that iconic era of fashion and music comes together and you did it so beautifully. Oh. I mean, Hannah, this whole collection, no matter what your age is, everybody can wear this. Well, piece. we couldn't have done it without Debbie. She was involved in the design of every single piece. So we're, her, uh, her input was obviously needed. Without her, we wouldn't have this. Okay. So we're, we're excited that we're bringing it to HSN exclusively. Debbie, I've got to ask, how would you wear... And Julian, you'd, how would you wear a bolero? Would you mirror this back with jeans? How would you like to like envision our customer wearing, especially the gold? Well, I don't know. For me, I guess uh, that uh, I would, you know, keep it as simple as possible. But um, maybe with something leather would be nice. Ooh. Leather pants. Yeah. Ooh, Juliana. I was also going to say I love the way Debbie layered. It with mm -hmm. her jacket, and I think it's it could be really cute, even layered with the leather jacket, oh. ultra luxe leather jacket that we're going to talk about in a little bit. But I love that yeah. kind of glam with the leather, yes. give it a little edge glam. The nice thing too about this jacket that I'm thinking of it for myself <laughs> is it's year round. You can yeah. wear it yeah. all year round. You yeah. can wear it with denim. You can wear it with a little legging and dress it down a little bit with sneakers. Good you know, point. make it super cool and like fun and young. There's so many ways to dress this up or dress this down. You could wear this over a cocktail dress. That's so, true. you know, it really, there are so many ways you can wear this. Oh, look and how great the girls look. But the it best really part about it, you're gonna walk into a room, all your friends are gonna ask, where did you get that jacket? Because it's so special. It is so special. And it is fun, you know, I mean, primarily. That's, exactly. That's, it's a fun piece. Yeah. And I have to ask Chris about, when you would photograph Debbie in sequence, was that one of your favorite, like to photograph her in sequins and sparkle, or was it always more casual? It was just, it was different. You know, she was always a great model and inspiring, certainly so. And still to this day, always inspiring. <laughs> <laughs> and you can get the style home again. When you look at the girls, I love the style tips that we're sharing with everybody, because it's not something you always have to be dressed up with, right? No. I mean, you can always make this casual, but the point is it really is a once in a lifetime chance for you to get something that no one else in the world is going to have. So if you really are looking for something special, something unique, something that nobody else is gonna have, this is it. It is our final quantity. We have this in extra small all the way through 3X on this. It's 22 and a quarter inches in length, so it's a true bolero style. Yeah, absolutely. And I even think when you look at, do I buy the bowl or the black or do I buy the gold? I think the black is a no-brainer. The gold is if you want to take a little walk and have some fun with fashion. Yeah. You know what I mean? Be on the wild mm -hmm. side. Yeah. And you know, it is one of those, it's, who doesn't have a sequin jacket? You really need to have one of these as, as uh, a staple in your wardrobe. But it's a little updated. And I have to point out, there's actually a pattern on this. Maybe your TV can't see it. There's a pattern, maybe it shows better on the gold, but yes. there is a pattern on both the black and gold. And by the way, there's 300 left in the black before these sell out. But there is a pattern. I've got to ask you a little yes. bit about why the pattern was done. It's almost like glass shattering. Yeah, and what I love about the gold sequence is that it's matte. You, I don't know if you could see it on the, on the TV. It looks like it's a little bit shiny, but this is actually a muted gold. So it's, uh, it's got that vintage feel and that was one of the reasons we chose this particular sequin pattern. Do you see that? So there is that little bit of a, a pattern to it. So it's not just flat and it's not boring. It's not that super shiny. It's that matte finish to it. So I love that you can mix your metals back with whether it is the gold or even the black. It's under $25. Don't forget we take every single major credit card here for this truly once in a lifetime event that we have here with Lyric Culture and Blondie. It's a thrill to have everybody shopping with us because when you look at fashion, there's fashion that you're like, yeah, you're kind of bored with. With, and then there's that wow you can have yeah. fun with fashion and that's what we love that Debbie and Chris are bringing to us with Juliana because I think we all get in a rut I don't know about you but I, I get in a 
I reach yes. for that same pair of jeans, that same shirt, and it's like, how do I spice it up? Chris, same thing? I have a wardrobe of black t-shirts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's it, just black yeah. t-shirts. Just yeah. black t-shirts. I was just saying, yeah. you don't seem like you get in a rut, because you have always had the most amazing sense of style. And you've been a pioneer when it comes to style. Oh, so do you ever you. wake up in the morning and go, what do I wear today? I just can't think of anything good to wear today. Or does it always come naturally to you? Well, I think when I get up in the morning, I, you know, have work to do, something like that. So I'll just put on something that's very functional. Uh-huh. And, um, but then, you know, when it comes to my other job. Right. In terms <laughs> of going out and, yeah. and getting ready to go out. and Yeah. No, and I, I, it takes me a while to decide. But, really? you know. It has to. It has to feel right. It has to feel and right. And it, it's something instinctive for me, you know. And I, I if I put something on, and I, you know, I sort of walk around and say, "Oops, not right," you know. And then I just start over. Mm -hmm. But um, you know, sometimes it has to be a quick decision. Right. And that's when one of those is exactly simple right. and easy. That's so true. And the yeah. gold one, by the way, is amazing. I mean, the black is a no-brainer, but the gold mm -hmm. one metallics are obviously having a huge moment right now, yeah. even on the red carpet, in the gowns we saw this past weekend, there were a lot of beautiful metallic yes. gowns. I love that gold, that's stunning. That. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad that you're loving it too. We love Juliana on the red carpet, looking fabulous in her dress, that blue dress. But coming up, we have for you, first look, hand sign, negative, knee blondie, and the advent of punk, it's signed. It's only $49.90. It's on three interest free credit card payments, $16.63. Hand sign book. Oh, there's only 100 left. Okay, that's it. 100 left. Well, they're signed by Chris Stein. You guys better get them calling fast. They're going. Think about that. So well, I can. This is amazing. The, the photography in here is absolutely unbelievable. Dang. You know what I have to say, Debbie? You look exactly the same. <laughs> you really do. Yeah. Thank you. you I'm telling you, you really look exactly do. the same in here in these pictures, which are a lot of behind the scenes never seen before, that you do as beautiful right now as you're sitting here. Time for an eye exam. No. <laughs> Coming at you. <laughs> Am I right, Juliana? No, it's true. Huh? I'm, I'm sitting here amazing. right in front of her. And I'm, that's what I'm thinking half the time is how stunning she is, and it is Thank amazing. You. I mean, Thank you very much. Yes, you look She's gorgeous. She's holding up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we've got a lot more that we're going to be sharing with you. This is a Lyric Culture Blonde event, and now it's time. Everybody's been asking about this amazing tea coming up next. Now, I will I will fair warn everybody, this is in sellout quantity, never seen before. It has grommets on it. It's $5 off in black, heather gray, or white. This is it. Again, when they're sold out, they're, do they're, they're done. They're never coming back. So we'll show you all three <clears throat> options here. You can see the white one has the taxi, and it has blondie. The gray, which is a heathered gray, or the black are your options here. So we'll kind of show them here up front. I love what you did yeah. with these. Because the graphic so, tees yeah. are so like on trend right now and you're seeing them in the runways. Talk about on trend, Debbie invented them. She was the first one that wore these graphic tees. But this one I love, the um, the blondie one way or another with the taxi. And the taxi is so uh, quintessential to the uh, the band because, mm -hmm. you know, they were part of that whole New York scene. And their music and the style was so infused with the essence of New York City. And, and I heard that Debbie and Chris loved the movie Taxi Driver. Yeah, I mean, what do you think of when you think of New York? You know, smoking manhole covers. <laughs> yeah. So we've got the taxi. And here's the cool thing on the inside. Uh -huh. We have, I don't know if you could see this, but we have handwritten lyrics. Debbie hand wrote these. This is one way or another on the inside of these. Um, here we have the Heart of Glass Favorite. lyrics on the inside. Favorite. This will be the first to sell out. And this is what we're calling the Heathered Gray, even though it's white. Mm. But there you can see there's Blondie. Look how beautiful. And this isn't just a t-shirt. We have the grommets here, which give it that punk rock little bit of an edge. This is also a very interesting shirt. This is from the lyrics from the song Rapture. And now all the musicians, all these girls are rapping and they're mixing it in with their music. Debbie was the first one that rapped. Yeah, I this, this that. was the first with Fab Five, Fra Fab Five. Fast, mm -hmm. Flash is fast, Flash is cool. That was like to Grandmaster Flash. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> wow. Amazing. Okay, Love there that. you can see, there's the tees. We're kind of sharing that with so you. Cool. There's only 500 left. So if you're not in the ordering process, we'll let you know when these do sell out because they will be gone this presentation here. White's my favorite. It's that, that iconic, I mean, that picture right there. Yes. Back with the moto jacket is just, it's, it's forever iconic. It and, really is. And when you're going to go see Blondie on tour with Garbage, you have to wear one of these shirts to the concert, right? How this great. is great. 
Oh, I love it. Well, we're yeah. going to head out to our phones. Beth's calling us from Connecticut. Welcome to HSN. You're live on there. How are you doing tonight? I'm well. How are you? Good. Are you enjoying the show? I, I am. My aunt called me and told me because I just got um, my concert tickets uh, to see Blondie in Garbage in Boston on July 30th, and I'm so excited. Oh, congratulations. Great, great. Thanks for your support. So yeah. I just bought a shirt, and um, I bought it in black, but now I want to get it in white, too, <laughs> because I really like the white. Oh, thanks, um, Beth. And I bought the CD, so I'm so excited to see them. I saw them back when I was a little younger at uh, CBGB in New York. And um, Good girl. So. Good girl. <laughs> What's your favorite song? Uh, you know, I, I think probably Accidents Never Happen. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's um, a good one. That's a good one. Which, uh, I don't know, I've been, and I have to say, like, when I found out that they were, um, that they were coming, um, I've been listening to uh, the Blondie CDs, like, for the, all week. So, Aww. thank you. I'm so excited. Thank Aww. you. Well, we're glad that yeah. they're here so with us at HSN. I, I have, like, ten people coming to the concert. Oh, thank okay. you, sweetie. Cool. Thank you. Oh, well, we're glad that you found your concert shirts here. I mean, come on. Nobody else is going to have the same shirt you're going to have. Yeah, right, right. Oh, you well, thank you. shirts, too? Huh? I have a 16-year-old son who um, would love a shirt. Do you make boys, like, men's clothing, too? No, but, you know, I don't know how big he is, but we have extra, extra large. Oh, well, he's tiny. Oh, okay. Well, we'll get well, him an extra go. small. Right here, we've got, how about in a black one? Uh, yeah, he might steal my black And one, the scarves but. are unisex, too, so we can do the there scarves. There you go, Beth. We got you covered. Enjoy yeah. the concert in Boston. You're going to have a wonderful time. And uh, thank you so much for shopping with us. Bye, Beth. Okay, so we're going to give you some quick updates. We've got three colors, extra small, all the way through 3X available. Whether you are going to the concert, and Deb and Chris, I've got to ask, when does your concert tour start? <laughs> we need a date. Well, uh, <laughs> the one in the date. States with garbage, I guess, starts in, in July. In beginning July? Of July. You know. That's as much as I know. Okay. Mm. But I'm packed. My there you go. <laughs> My suitcase is never unpacked. Oh. <laughs> well, there you go. So, again, make sure you check where you live at to see when the tour does start with garbage. Quick update on this. The Heather Gray? Okay. It's just about gone. Okay. Which is this one here. So, which and again, what's face. really cool, that, that, exactly, what's really cool about these, again, is the lyrics on the inside, so you can wear them close to your heart. That was sort of the inspiration oh. behind putting the lyrics on the inside, and you can, uh, and that's, again, like your little secret, just like with the sequin jacket, where we tried to put a lot of detail on, uh, in these garments, so it's not just a t-shirt. You've See? got the detail here with the grommets. You've got the lyrics to the entire song on the inside. Again, the taxi one, one way or another, has uh, Debbie's handwritten lyrics. Wow, is that To cool? one way or another. So when, when we perform, we see people with those shirts on, we expect them to take the shirts off so that they can, you know, read the lyrics and sing along. Oh! There we go. So it's, you know. Make sure you put the shirt back on, though, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> you actually well, get two guys, shirts. I don't know why I said just women, guys. Hey, guys, do not yeah. put the shirt back on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. And you really get two shirts in one because you could reverse it and wear it inside out and have the lyrics on the outside. Exactly. So there's two ways to wear it. That's so yeah. true. Yeah. And, and these are real lyrics. Don't, you know, we see fake lyrics on eBay and stuff. So. Oh, really? Oh. These, are yeah. the real. these are real. These are real. Okay. You wrote them. Uh, I, I did. <laughs> yeah, where else are you going to get a Blondie t-shirt with handwritten lyrics by Debbie Harry? Amazing. Only here at HSN. It's a limited edition. It's a big capsule event that we've got with Lyric Culture right now. So thank you again for all of your orders. Before it does sell out, we're going to head back out to our phones. Darren's giving us a call from Vermont. Welcome to HSN. You're live on the air. How are you doing tonight? Good. How are you guys? We're doing great. What do you think of the show so far? Say They're hello gorgeous. to Debbie. I just wish I was a girl so I could wear them. <laughs> what do you think, Debbie and Chris? I think a guy could get away with some of this. Yeah. I, yes, I... I mean, if it, it's a shirt with Debbie on it, I'll wear it. There we okay. go. Uh, look, look oh. all, Mick Jagger, Steven Tyler, they all wear women's jeans. Like, I mean, that's hey, how it is. If true. you're a true rock star, you can definitely wear women's clothing. That's exactly right. 
Well, we're glad that you're shopping with us. We heard you picked up the CD, which comes out 5-5 five, five Cinco de Mayo, as well as the calendar with Debbie on it. We appreciate you shopping with us. And isn't it cool that they're here? Yeah, hello. Come on out. Talk about, talk about pure beauty. I know. I know. She is. She's beautiful. Thank you so much, Darren, for being part of our show. They're moving us along. Thank you so much. Take good care. Bye-bye. It's true. We have so much to get to, and, and inner and outer beauty is exactly what Chris and everybody's yes. about here with us. But I know Juliana is going to be sharing with us some, you know, insiders of what's going on. Well, I got to say, Amy, they have, you have so much going on. Okay, the clothing, oh. uh, CD, uh, book tour mm -hmm. and also you have a PBS special that's airing right yes. throughout the month of March let's take a quick look at it and then I want to ask you about it okay a little bit about uh, that special that's airing well uh, we did it we did it quite a while ago that that particular song is uh, from the new collection it's called uh, my monster my monster yeah yeah and uh, was it written by Johnny Marr uh-huh used to be in the Smiths nice yeah so uh, it's part of our, you know, ongoing, you know, pollinator kind of thing. Got it. And um, they did a great job with the show. They mixed it like a record. Really? Yeah. yeah, yeah the audio terrific. was terrific. So it's yeah. a cool special. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. All right, I'm excited. And we had a, a great lighting designed by Rob Roth. And uh, I, I think it was the first time we had played in, in quite a while. Really? So it was pretty exciting for us. And they had a live audience. Uh huh. You know, it was the supporting. first time we had played some of those new songs yeah. too. Yeah. Yeah. How does it feel going on stage? I mean, you you know, you've been on so many stages, you've performed for so many years. What's it like performing now, as we see this clip here? What's it like performing now uh, compared to when you first started? Oh, <laughs> well, it's technically, it's a lot easier now. Yeah, the equipment has improved over the years, and um, of course, we've had a lot of practice. Yeah, that's a lot of practice, yeah. right? <laughs> a do lot you get of butterflies out. anymore? Do you get Do you get nervous going on stage? I, I do get excited. Excited, but it's yeah, not like it's a, not the same kind of raw panic. Yeah, that we used to experience <laughs> in our younger days. Yeah, yeah. raw panic. I love that. <laughs> What does raw panic feel like? I only know one level of panic, I think most of us do. But I can only imagine because, you know, you were put on, your level was here. It's like, how do you constantly outdo yourself, right? I don't know if we looked at it quite like that. Yeah. You know, it's just sort of an ongoing, uh, you know, just a, an assault, actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm so glad. To, it's it's nice hearing behind the scenes because, you know, we get a chance to know both of you a little bit better and especially talking about fashion tonight because we do have lyric culture with us and we are moving on. We do want to remind everybody about the book called Negative, Me, Blondie, and the Advent of Punk. It's a signed book. I don't know how many more of these we have remaining. Um, I think there's maybe a dozen. That's it. It's $16.63. So, again, it's something very limited that we have and this is a behind the scenes look mm -hmm. at pictures Chris you never shared with the world before so this some book. of them are out in the world but there's a lot of stuff that is unique to the book that's kind of behind the scenes that yeah never... it's a little bit of everything you know I was just always had a camera and I was always uh, I was lucky enough to be in the middle of this whole scene as it developed it's, yeah. Uh, yeah, the pictures are beautiful. Yeah, he's Thanks. quite a, quite a wonderful photographer. Thanks. Um, I I uh, I recommend him highly. <laughs> <laughs> no, he has a great great sense, and somehow uh, it's wow. always amazing to me a photographer's eye. And, and Chris has a wonderful vision of life. You know, it, 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 sh it comes right through. Oh. I mean, there, there are really some pictures in here. You'd love to know the behind the scenes, like well, how that ever came to happen. Pretty, they all have little anecdotes, pretty yes, much. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. The cover shot, for one, was taken at the... Um, the Sleaze Convention. Sleaze Convention. In Delaware. In Delaware. Wow. About a dozen left, that's it. 
Yeah, Wilmington, Delaware. Uh, John Waters uh, and Edie the Egg Lady were there. And uh, yeah. what, what's the other guy that was there? The, the, the tall guy. I don't know. Uh, can't remember. Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. They have to get the book to know the rest of it. It's all inside of here. Anyway, look at these great pictures. There was a picture of you with David Bowie in here. Yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, there's just, it's beautiful pictures. Especially of you just being fun and free. And you'll see a lot of the fashions coming to life tonight. I love this picture here. I love that picture. Yeah, I, I love that too, the vulture. Yes. Yeah. And uh, that's a, a belt that I stole from Handsome Dick Ma Manitoba. And uh, eventually, you know, he let me keep it. <laughs> okay, you know what? I, there's just, there's so many fun, unique stories. If you are a lover of Blondie, you've got to be ordering this now. We will be stamping this sold out for everybody that's ordering it. Again, this is signed by Chris. You can see right inside. So we were only able to secure a certain amount of these, and it will sell out. So we can see a lot of you order. We're going to be stamping it sold out. If you're not in the ordering process, I don't know where else you would find a book like this signed. So, again, thank you. If you want Debbie to sign it, come to the show. Get a copy and bring it to the ah. show. Yeah, that'd be fantastic. Anyway, it's just, it's a gorgeous book. Are you oh, kidding really? me? <laughs> okay, there's this a surprise. Do you wanna do this now? Okay. okay, real quick, we have a surprise caller. Our very own Wendy Williams. You know Wendy Williams is yes. Hello, Miss Wendy, you're live on the air with Debbie, how are you? Uh, how are you doing, Amy? How you doing? <laughs> it's Debbie and Chris, how are you doing? Hi, Wendy. Deborah, I am a fan. I ordered the T-shirt, the one that was in the middle that said Blondie across in like a subway type writing, uh -huh. the yellow with the black and white checkerboard. Yeah. I have loved you since forever. Yes, and I hate to be cliche, but my favorite song is Heart of Glass. Oh. Okay, let's hear you sing Thank it. Come you, on, Wendy. Wendy. Thank you. Can you say when you come to New York, yeah. Deborah? Yeah. I'm not trying. I'm not trying to book the talk show. All I'm saying is, <laughs> girl, I I'm watch through. you. I watch you. Thank you, Deborah. Amy, girl, love you. I miss you. I miss you more. <laughs> Big kiss. Have a wonderful night. Thank you for calling in, Wendy. Yes. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, -bye. Okay, we've got a lot to get to in the next, what, hour and a half. So we're going to have more behind the scenes. We've got a lot of great clothes to get to. Of course, keep the phone calls coming. We'd love to hear from you. Please be part of our show. That number to dial is 1-866-876-3762. Uh, so tell us what you love, maybe about the collection. Maybe you're going to be going to see Blondie in concert. Wouldn't that be great? We have for you coming up the jeans that everybody's been wearing. This is our G by Juliana line with Lyric Culture here. This is the Blondie. Bondi five piece patch set first that we're gonna be talking about for $19.90. You know what, patchwork is done on shoes, it's done on handbags, it's done on jeans. It's one of the biggest looks right now and you can get a set of five for $19.90. It's also available on two interest free credit card payments. Love it on the sequin jacket. That is so smart. So we have, oh, you have them here, okay. We have these patches. Um, this one, you the, fo the favorite photo that you were just referring to in yes. Chris's book, um, that Debbie was wearing the, uh, the t-shirt. Oh, there you go. There it is. Um, can you tell us a little bit where you found this shirt? And oh boy, the, the Vulture shirt dates back probably to the late 60s. And it was a couple of buddies of mine in Brooklyn found it in a sporting goods store and we never found out what it was or what the vultures were. And it was passed around the family and eventually Debbie wound up with it. And we have it framed now as kind of a artifact. Yeah, oh, I it love is, that. yeah, I mean, that is, Debbie Harry wore these t-shirts the graphic shirts, but now everybody wears them. Like you said, everybody they're so on trend. She was the first one that did it, so that was one of the first so logos. So we'll show all of them real quick yes. here because these are on their way selling out too. This is the taxi again, okay. um, New York. Like they said, they were inspired by taxi driver. Love this one. I think this was made by, designed yeah, by Shepard Ferry, Shepherd, yeah. Shepherd, yeah. who yeah. did the Obama oh, yes. poster. Yeah. Right, and then we have this super cute blondie. Yep, and the last one, Blondie Forever. And you could put these on your jeans, on the sequin jacket, Absolutely. on the moto jacket. I mean, this takes your clothes Pin to on. an entirely different level. Absolutely, so we have all of them available. It's only $19.90. Whatever you wanna do with them, it's up to you. It is a big, big look. So again, you receive all five. 
So we are gonna give everybody a quick little update because everything is limited. This is a capsule event that Lyric Culture put together with Debbie and Chris and combining today, today all of this looks together, even with G by Juliana is gonna be coming up. Daniel Nicole's got a great little bag we're gonna be talking about. We did sell out of the negative me, Blondie, and the Advent Pack, so congratulations. Everybody's loving the book sign, so thank That's you so great. much, Chris, for That's doing great. that. Okay, we do wanna move on. We've got a lot to get to, like the jeans, finally. At $74.90, truly hot off the red carpet. Juliana Ransom is joining us with G by Juliana, sold exclusively here at HSN. You know, working with Hannah, as well as our entire team to create these jeans. Yeah. Have you slept yet since Sunday? Uh, the big red carpet? Like no. two hours. On the plane. <laughs> All good though. All oh, good. good. I'm happy to be here. Are you kidding? I know. This is major. So I, know. Uh, I, I would know. not miss this for the world. Okay, there's 700 left. That's it. You have this in the light and the medium wash here. Yeah. This is done in the number one most requested new silhouette, which is called the boyfriend. Yes. It's $24.97 to get home, but it's a stretch denim. And again, we've already sold out of black. We didn't even get a chance to air it. Black's gone. Are you serious? Yeah, black I was sold wondering out. where. Really? Yeah, black is sold out. Oh my God, love that. Um, yeah, I mean, how cute are these? They have a little bit of stretch to them, so not only are they super fashionable, uh, but they're very comfortable too. And you were talking about comfort before, and it yeah. is important. Yeah. And these days, you don't have to sacrifice comfort for fashion. You used to have to do that once upon a time, but you don't have to do that anymore. So yeah, these jeans are the, you know, that boyfriend style. This has been my best selling denim since oh, yeah. I launched denim a couple of years ago here, the boyfriend jean. I think there's over 800 reviews online of the boyfriend jean. Women have loved them. I think over 500 five-star reviews online. So this is the Everybody best. I love this. It's comfortable, it's fashionable. Dress it up, dress it down, and of course, it's got the blondie touch to it. It does. And we're so they, it makes that. it even more special. Let's talk a little bit about that because right yeah. here, it's just little subtle things. And I love how you've got blondie in the back, on the back label of it. I mean, That's it's right. just, it's really edgy and fun. It, it's, I mean, I'm wearing them. All the girls are wearing them. It, it's just a really fun style, size of zero all the way through 24. So I think it's important to stress. We've got everybody's size. And when these sell out, Never to be done again. This is your one and only chance. Yep, exactly. And so you can see if we want to do a little zoom in action here, you know, just the little touch oh, yeah, with the yeah. blondie and cursive, so pretty. Just love, love, love. And honestly, you're right. This collection, once we're sold out, uh, it's over, you know? So we're not, I know, I know, it is sad. But at the same time, it is your opportunity. You're lucky to be watching. I know there's tons of people, by the way, I'm seeing. I've never seen so many people online I at know, one point I ordering. Know. So. Definitely call in or go online, get yours while you can, while we have the size you want, while we have the wash you want. Um, but I just, I love these, and I gotta be honest with you, I'm wearing um, the darker wash, but I love the faded. Isn't it gorgeous? Do you Isn't know, it's just a summer, throwback, right? I've gotta ask too, Deborah, what is your favorite like wash or style in denim? What was it you loved? I, mean, I, and Chris I actually Bodeman. do like the light. Actually. You like the light? Yeah, I do. The light. And I, I love the, you know, I had a, a shredded vest that I I wore till it completely fell apart, and that was very that had that washed look, and yeah. it, it it was washed. And it was. <laughs> and Chris, what's your <laughs> favorite to photo? Vest. And we've got the vest coming out, by the way. Yeah. yeah. What's your favorite when you're photographing? Do you oh, like the light or the dark, or is it? I you know I the light stuff is cool. I I am drawn to dark shades myself, but you know there was a time back in the old days when you couldn't get any of this stuff. It was just very. You know, I remember going to the to a the first time we were in Japan and seeing many colors of jeans and being amazed, you know, because it yeah. just didn't exist. So, yeah. How lucky are we now that it's many colors, not just of, of denim, but even in the jackets and different washes and mm -hmm. textures. And thank God spandex came into our lives and is now in jeans so we can bend and move. And, you know, <laughs> exactly. they move with our body. And I'm sure when you were on stage, I mean, the jeans didn't move then. Denim was stiff. It didn't, you know, didn't work well with your body. Comfort was zero. Unless you, you know, got them secondhand. Yeah. You know. Worn in a little bit. Yeah. Well, luckily, some... Juliana does all that. She wears every pair of jeans <laughs> to wear them in for you. <laughs> I do. That's what I spend wow. my weekends doing. Every I know, day. do you see how committed I am? Uh, <laughs> but I just wanted to say real quick, there's a lot I want to say, but I want to say real quick, if you did pick up a t-shirt, obviously the denim goes perfectly with all the t-shirts. It's just such a cool, 
look. Yeah, it I really love, is. love, love this look. It's effortless, it's cool, it's got edge. Love everything about it. And also, I gotta tell you, I just posted on Instagram earlier and I got so many nice comments. People are loving the head-to-toe denim right. look too, which is so cool. And I know yeah, some women fun. hesitate with that, but fashion is meant to be fun. It's not permanent. No. Have fun with fashion, ladies. No. You know, so get the pieces and mix and match, obviously, but wear them head to toe, too. They look so cool together. Well, well that's, say, that, yeah, that's one yeah. of the things that Sprouse actually taught me, you know, about um, keeping the line fluid and, and not blocking yes. it up. No, not sort of keeping that color going. Exactly. It, it's much better for your figure. You're right. And yes. it's so on trend right now, oh, too. absolutely. Yeah. So we've got the vest coming up. If you want the jeans, you've got to be ordering now. Uh, there's a couple dozen in each size, sizes 0 through 24 women's. It's the boyfriend, which means it's a relaxed leg style. So again, order these true to style, or true to size, excuse me. And we've got them for under $25. Hey, we're just getting the party started. We still have an hour <laughs> of amazing behind the scenes. And of course, walking down memory lane with Blondie, G by Juliana designing exclusively for us with lyric culture. So we're bringing together that iconic style that started in the 70s and 80s and made such a huge impact in the world of fashion. Everything that you're seeing, like I said, is limited, once in a lifetime chance. We have for you the amazing Blondie denim vest that goes back with this jean, or you can wear it back with leather pants. Whatever you Any, want. whatever you want. A great That's layering nice. piece, but the best part, oh my gosh, how adorable with the red blondie on this. I just, oh Red my jeans? God. I can't even. Yeah. Or like jeans and a red heat pump. Ooh, you I know. like that. Go crazy, girl. Look at that. So again, same color theme, lighter, medium. Black is completely sold out. It's under $30. So we've got it for you on sale. It's our spring price. But before we go into details, is it Michelle from New York? Oh, Michael, excuse me, I'm sorry. Whew. I can't see that far, Michael, I'm sorry. You're live on air with us. How are you doing tonight? Hi, Juliana. Hi, Chris. Hi, Debbie. Hi. Big fan. Hi, Michael. How are you? Good, good. I got a question for you about some uh, your your inspirations of art. I know you have a famous um, relationship with uh, Shepard Ferry, and my friend Scooter did some shirts for you right. on the No Principles tour. Right. I'm just wondering um, what artists now are influencing you and inspiring you guys. Well, there's a lot of great young artists. I, there's a, you know, I do a lot of stuff on Instagram. This is a good opportunity to say everybody follow me on Instagram. I can, if all 90 million of you follow me, I will have more followers than Kylie Jenner. True. That was his goal today. That's he told my story. goal. Um, Thank God. There's a guy named. There's a, there's a guy I really like. His name is Daniel Arsham. He's a sculptor out of New York, uh, terrific. A lot of stuff, it's a lot of people. Yeah. Excellent, well thank you guys. I'm looking forward to the show at the Beacon. Great, great, Ooh. thank you. Thank you, thank you so much, Michael. <laughs> Thanks, Michael. We appreciate you shopping with us. Bye-bye. Bye. Hey, you got the CD, which is coming out Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo, and you know what's really funny? That's my cousin's birthday. Oh. My cousin Jane was born on Cinco de Mayo. And somebody else, too. Uh, Good maybe look it up. one of Matt's kids, I think. Yeah? Yeah, I think so. Maybe. It's going to be a big day. Yeah. yeah. Birthdays, CD yeah, releases. Yeah. So pick up your, your amazing looks right now. So when you do get the CD home, you can rock out your new look. And I do want to point out, Julianne, there's a lot of little details that we want to go through with this vest. First of all, the length is the sweet spot in a vest. You don't want them too short where they're bolero or too long, then it looks like a duster. Yeah, exactly. No, not at all. And you, yeah, right. Because you saw the jacket before the sequin jacket had that little, little bit of higher. a higher super fashion yes. cut. This one, I think all women can really enjoy. Easy to layer with, or like we said before, just, you know, you don't even, you, you could have a t-shirt tucked in underneath if you want to just do like a really cool throwback look. But otherwise you can layer with it. The blouse I have on, it, you know, it, wearing the vest and I wear the vest with it sometimes, it changes the look completely. Oh, absolutely. And just makes it like, super hip, hip, super rocker, love, love, love. So yeah, this vest is so cute. I know that it's, we're really busy with the vest, so definitely 
Get yours while you can. But I love this with the red and the little music note on the oh button. So cute. On the button. So cute, right? And there's a lot of little details. I just put on the moto coming up. Yes. And I have to say, Debbie, thank you because nobody, you made the moto jacket what it is today. You were the first, honestly, no, to no, bring it into no, fashion, no. you really no, made it acceptable no, for the fashion world to wear. Yes? You know, Harley Davidson, all the motorcycle guys warm, but you made it iconic in the fashion world. I, I, I can't really, I feel, thank Thank you for the credit, but I really feel like it was the Ramones that did that. Don't you think? Well, I don't know. Maybe Chris. not so much in like the world of Vogue, etc. Uh, okay. You know. <laughs> so like, fine. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll take, take it. it. Never mind. If Chris has it, I can take it then. Okay, well, we've got a lot more to look it. forward to. In fact, Hana standing by. Ooh, looking great with Lori. Look at these two looks, how great you guys are. I, I, like we talk about, I'm obsessed with this scarf. I love the way she's wearing this with the handwritten lyrics of One Way or Another, handwritten by Debbie Harry. And, you know, throughout this, the last hour, we've been talking about some of these amazing songs. I mean, Debbie Harry and Chris Stein, literally, one hit after another. And, and like Lennon McCartney, just kept cranking out those hits. And now with this new album, Pollinator, the songs are amazing. You guys have to go out and get this. I mean, they've sold 40 million albums. There's going to be like another 40 million, right? Well, that would be nice. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now we're moving on to Juliana's blouse that a lot of you have been asking about, which would be perfect underneath the vest. Mm -hmm. So many different ways that you can wear this. In the white or the red, I love that you can be really edgy and fun or classic with the skirt and pumps. That's exactly. Cute. Different ways you want to wear it's it. It's unbelievable because you can wear this to a concert and style it a certain way. And then you can wear it to work. Like you said, a pencil skirt, mm -hmm. a pair of nice, you know, black pants and a pump. So like I said, you know, it's funny because if you're tuning in and you definitely want some of that rocker feel, but you also want to be able to wear these pieces every day. This is a great piece for that. And I love it. By the way, I had it in a bow earlier. Cute. I had it in a low bow and then I untied it. So there's all these different ways you can style it. And the best part. Can you guys get a closer with this? How oh, is how that? cute is this? Yes, we couldn't leave it out. Blondie. So adorable, right? So just that little detail, so beautiful. It makes this so unique. And of course, a collector's item, really, exactly. at the end of the day. Uh, and something you'll have forever. And even hand down to your, to your little girl. And could you tie this? You know how the big look right now around the neck? You could even tie this. Absolutely. Tie it around the neck so it almost looks like you've got that, you know, well, black necklace on. But I also, in every piece, we wanted to design the pieces to have a lot of versatility and to let you really just experiment and have fun. That's exactly what you're all about, Debbie. You know, Debbie did things that, with clothing and obviously yeah. music, but with clothing too and fashion, that young women everywhere looked at her and were like, oh my God, and suddenly they started look. doing it yes. and imitating her and, and rocking those looks. And I think that that's what's so cool about these pieces is, Look, they can be styled the way we're showing it to you or the right. way I have it on, but you certainly have creative freedom to experiment and do whatever you want with them, too. All right, we're going to head back out to our phones. This time, New Jersey. Is it Astria? Astria, hi. Hi, Astria. Hi. How are you? On the air. Oh, hi. It's Chris, Debbie, Julian, and Amy. How are you doing tonight? And how is oh here? Oh, my God, I feel like my heart is about to explode. I'm so excited and nervous. Oh, don't be nervous. Astria, hi. <laughs> Hi, I'm the biggest fan. Oh my god, I'm so happy you guys are doing this clothing line because I, I think it's the best idea and it's going to sell out completely because it's absolutely amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Aw, so we heard you were able to pick up the vest. Juliana's vest? Yep, yep, and um, I, I'm going to definitely buy like 10 more things tonight. <laughs> Wait till you see the jacket, the moto jacket. It's really cute. Oh, yes. Austria, how oh, do you God, think I you're... Love, I love black leather jackets with studs. Anything black leather is my thing. How are you going to style the vest? Like, what about the vest made you want to grab it tonight? Well, first of all, I love vests. I think they're, they're still so, so trendy. Yeah. Anything like that. I, I would love... The patches, I love. I think those are so cute. Um, and I love, I love pins. I love putting them on because they just can't go wrong with that. <laughs> no. Yeah, and that's right. We didn't even talk about the patches that are so adorable that people are loving. Adding those to the vest. Oh, super good point. cute look. Yes. Yeah, you could do all of that. Oh, Estrella, thank you so much for giving us a call. Of we course. appreciate it. <gasps> well, enjoy the show. With thank you so much. Thank you. We've got another hour coming up. Awesome. I'll be tuning in. Yay. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Bye, everyone. Bye. Good night. Bye-bye.
Okay. We still have, so unfortunately we do have a lot of you ordering, so we do have a hold. It's quick and easy to set up an account, or it's actually free for you to set up an app on your smartphone or whatever phone you've got. We've got free apps where you put you to the front of the line because everything is in sellout quantity. The book sold out. If you want the jacket, very limited as well. Coming up next hour as our big Lyric Culture event continues. HSN mobile app is convenient and easy to use for all of your HSN shopping needs. On the app, it's so easy to find the item you want and place your order within seconds. Read the product descriptions and reviews before you purchase, or watch a live feed of HSN and purchase the airing item and other items that have recently aired. Just go to hsn.com and search app to download now. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. Since 1939, HP has been an industry leader in technology, offering innovative, practical products at a great value. It's a tradition they carry on to this day. HP puts innovation at your fingertips. From desktops to laptops and printers to tablets, HSN has the latest in HP technology, so you can stay productive and stay connected wherever life takes you. HP, make it matter. Friday on HSN. introduce who's sitting next to us. I mean, honestly, this is Lyric Culture's huge event. We're so thrilled to have Debbie here and Chris Stein, the dynamic duo who started back in 1974 and now are icons in the industry with over 40 million records sold. And still to this day, your icons in fashion and music. And when we think about fashion and music, you made the two of them collide. We were talking about and it was, Debbie should take credit for, you know, the moto jackets, being so iconic. You made everything glamorous. Ah, thank you. Yes. Very glamorous. I could, I could take credit for that. I don't mind that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but now the music that we're hearing, you've got a brand new album coming out, Blondie Pollinator. Right. And it's coming out Cinco de Mayo. We're hearing some of the songs right now. And I've got to ask, what was your favorite song, Debbie? What was your best or oh, yours? from all? From all, or, or just actually from maybe this. on the CD, yes. Just from this. Um, um, fragments. I sort of am fascinated with fragments. Is but, your... uh, also fun. I and mean, fun, the, which is the single, so. Yes. You know. And Chris, what about you? I like the Johnny Marr song a lot, My Monster. Yeah. Um, but, you know, it's hard to pick one out of all this yeah. stuff. We always have problems picking, you know, one favorite because, you know, once we start playing them live, you know, you sort of, you sort of, go through one and then then another one grabs you and it's a different kind of life it's not it's a different kind of uh hearing i guess yeah. when, it, when it's your own song when it's your own song and yeah. it takes on its own life when you're on stage yeah. 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 On. Yeah. 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 Um, what's your favorite all-time song Debbie? i i always say rapture because you know it has so much going on in it and we've lived played it in so many different ways it's between rapture and heart of glass you know I remember Rapture in that video when it first came out. I was like, <gasps> who doesn't remember Rapture video? Hannah, do you remember? I mean, <laughs> I know. <laughs> still this day, the, you know, they still will play that. And I, I look and still in an awe of your beauty. Just, I mean, of awe and the way it, it all came together and you're just like it, still mesmerized by that video. And I mean, that was back, what, 1980? No, no, 78, we recorded. Yes! No, Andy's not, no, Andy, we never got Andy in the video. No. Yeah. No. Yeah, we had Jean-Michel Basquiat. 
Basquiat was yeah. in, is yeah. in yeah. the video. Yeah. yeah, right. And a lot of the graffiti artists were in it. Um, yes. It's pretty nice. It's pretty, pretty nice. Yeah, John Michelle is in a couple of videos. He's yeah. in the Atomic video, yeah. too. Yeah. Well, you've got a lot of new songs coming out of Pollinator. In fact, we're going to have everybody take a listen to them right now. I love it. You just got a little glimpse of what you're going to expect to hear. And not only on Pollinator, but we have five bonus tracks that are also coming to you by ordering it here on HSN or going to hsn.com. It's only $15.95. You can expect so much out of this new CD. It's so true to who you are. You know, when we listen, I, this is the first I've ever heard of it, but it's so true to what Blondie is. We yeah. hope so. Absolutely. We try harder. We try harder. <laughs> so you yeah. can get yours now in time for Cinco de Mayo. That's when we're guaranteeing that everybody will have them the day that it's launched. Yep. It's Cinco de Mayo 5-5, and you will have yours in your hot little hands on the 5th of May. So again, thank you again for all of your orders. We still see a lot of you ordering a lot of the fashions. The jacket that I'm wearing is going to be coming up, but we're going to share with you some more.